Hi, this is Agnes and welcome back to my channel. In front of me here, I have my goodies and these are my vintage and uh, antique uh, brooches. So they are my brooch collection. So some of them are antique, most of them actually antique. Antique is something more than 50 years old, I, I think. And um, uh, vintage is more than 20. So yeah, and then these two are my uh, vintage boxes where I store my jewelry. Um, I store these pieces. So yeah, you've got to excuse my hands. My hands are really, really dry because if you're a nurse, you can understand. We wash our hands on duty like, I don't know, several times just to protect our, um, to protect the people we are looking after. So you, you, yeah, so hands are dry despite putting lots of cream, they still remain dry. So let's get started. Let me show you my brooches in my collection. So, and um, my first one is this one, this beautiful brooch. This is a uh, real gold, and I don't know this name, I think uh, the stone, the name of the stone, I wish I knew, but it's antique piece. It's got gold markings on the back. It's just a pretty uh, brooch. I had this, I, my daughter wore this uh, on a prom day, on a prom dress. It's so, so beautiful, it's so pretty. So yeah, uh, next one I have my, another special um, I think it's a nine carat gold brooch. It's an A for my name. So yeah, there's another beautiful brooch that I like uh, so much. And another one that is really unique and very uh, antique um, is this one. It's, this is so old. Like, yeah, I don't know how old, but it's very, very antique. So for you, how do you know that your items are antique or, you know, because you can, I find these mostly from the um, thrift shops or uh, garage sales and things like that. So you, sometimes you have those, uh, the, like the antique road show, they pass by. If they're close to where you live, you can take it um, for them to sort of assess it for you to tell you how old your piece is. So this one I was told that is really old, like uh, 40s. 1940s it's really heavy and yeah but it's it's beautiful it's had some repair some of the stones that dropped off dropped out and i had it uh, i had them fixed again so there's two types of stones there there's this clear one and it's like a dark, dark uh gray or something so here's another sterling silver one which is a, a music note it's got that tarnish the silver tarnish but it's so beautiful I like it. Um, I'm just gonna open this so I can put some of them in there. And oh, this is another antique. I just thought I could show you antique sort of jewelry box that I thought I should show you. Uh, well, I keep my broken golds and silvers in here. So these are just some of broken, uh, real gold and real silver pieces. So that one day, if I want to have them repaired, I can have them repaired here's another antique piece this is not a brooch but it's just an antique watch that you wind up for it to work it's really old and i just like having it it's um real gold i don't know the name but it's an old old watch i think there's a name somewhere inside i don't know i haven't taken time to uh read that name i just like the fact that it's really old so yeah here's another piece that have is sterling silver this one beautiful piece i'll try to be quick because i have a lot of them to show you so here's the bird and i'll show you another bird i have a few birds together so that's that's a fish that's a bird that's a little card this is a pretty pretty brooch you see it's got the red eyes like the ruby eyes this is a real gold one it's so beautiful one of my best and it's just an ordinary brooch. Here's another bird. It's in a, I think a nine card gold. Here's another card. Look at that. That one has green eyes, but unfortunately that one lost one of its jet eyes. So look at the, <laughs> the, the um, ruby eyes. They're so pretty. Here's another bird. Um, it's another beautiful bird. Yeah. And, um, that's just like a, 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 a bouquet of flowers or something. But yeah, they're all so pretty. I, I just adore these pieces. 
So yeah, here's just an ordinary turquoise in pearl. And here's uh, like an ordinary round, uh, good for jackets and, and coats. And here's another like a button line, but it is a brooch. I've got another one like a flower. It's so beautiful as well. So I'll put those away. And then I'll show you my other favorite pieces. Um, this one and this one this one these two these are like my top um brushes i love them they're both sterling silver they all both have like um soroski crystals they've lost some of them but they're just so beautiful they are both uh antique really old like more than 30 years old and they just beautiful beautiful pieces to have here's another antique one similar to those but it's it's also old and here's another uh old one and here's another like a um, winter or autumn leaf and here's another old one but those two are just my best so let's carry on i have like a bowl one and then i have three mother of pearl um i don't know whether these are brushes or they're for scarves because this round bit on the back so let me know if you know how to use these i just normally put them on a pocket but if you know if they're for a scarf let me know the same applies to this one yeah they're also one of my beautiful pieces in my collection so I put those away and uh, i have another one here which is really vintage or, or um, antique. That's a Las Vegas one. I have a butterfly. I have another butterfly and another butterfly. These are really good for like a summer jacket, the butterflies. They're really cute. And I have like a crown. Let me show you. This is like a crown. Kind of, um, yeah, just simple. And then I have a beautiful rose. Look at that. That's so beautiful. This would be ideal for like a Valentine's dinner date outfit. And then I have another one, another bouquet of flowers right there. And, and then I have these two special ones. These are made in England. They are uh, not enamel. What would you call this? Um ceramic yeah that's the word they are ceramic brushes uh similar colors but made by the same company staffordshire in england uh they're also vintage so let's move those i'll show you some more i've got this one this is a beautiful one it's got a chain and it's very unique and very antique another antique pin uh brooch right here i've got another huge peacock this is beautiful it's, it's got a mark on the back so it's a huge peacock look at that i do for a jacket and um, can you see so that's a peacock and it's tail so it's not flashing its tail there and then i have a flashing tail but it's missing the peacock face there but i mean this is just gorgeous so let's put this away and I have like a Christmas wreath one. It looks like a Christmas wreath. Uh, if you can see that. I have another like Christmas wreath one here. And then I have this white one. And I have um, a cameo one right here. Beautiful, beautiful. Everything is just gorgeous. So let's have another one. Let's have this beautiful vintage. It moves about. So beautiful old, old piece. Here's another flashing peacock. Look at that. That is gorgeous. That is gorgeous. And I have a dog. Here's a dog. Beautiful. Beautiful. Let me know what you think. And if you know which one you like the best, let me know. Here's a dancing. Um, it's missing a stone there. Ballerina. It's so gorgeous as well. And I have another rose. Oh, I showed you the red one. Another one that would be ideal for like a, a dinner date, a Valentine's dinner date. And then I have a um, lizard. 
it looks real doesn't it it's got the scales and it's got this enamel bit on the on the middle but it's missing uh, some enamels there and there but it just looks real i like it it's just one of my favorite uh antique um in real life i am not a fan of lizards i am not a fan maybe that's why i like this one because i know i can play about with it but i am so scared of uh, lizards especially chameleons i get scared of them we used to have a lot of chameleons in africa so when you're getting some mangoes from the tree and then you come across it and then oh they just used to scare me so here's another bouquet of flowers and here is um like a, just a shape beautiful for a jacket and i have a fish look at that look at that beautiful 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 so i have a round one very antique you can see it's really old i have another old cameo you can see and i have a jaguar i think it's a jaguar that is so beautiful so yeah you see the others i have a sterling silver one right here another sterling silver ball and another sterling silver like this is a like, is it an, a butterfly or oh, yeah it looks to me it looks like a butterfly and then i have a shooting star and I have some kittens facing um, the other side. Yeah, so pretty. So I have a just a very antique one. So this one I'm thinking of repurposing this stone. If I get like, um, I'll see. I have to take it to a jewelry to probably use it and make me uh, like a silver sterling ring. This stone will be very, very nice. That's my plan for this one. And then I have a leaf. Again, it's got that round thing on the back. Let me know what it's used for. I'm not sure. And I have a tortoise. This is one of my best. Look at that little tortoise. It's just so, so gorgeous. Look. So pretty. And I have another bird right here. And then this is like the one you use for a jacket. Like you can put on the other side of the jacket. You use it like a closure thing. Yeah, it's quite old as well. Um... So, hope you're enjoying watching my brooches. But yeah, let me just wind up. And I've got a few left. This is one of my favorite. Let me show you. Um, it's just got attached to another one. So, um, it's attached to another brooch. Okay, yeah, I've loosened it. So, this is got a marking. It's like a 9 or 18 card very antique brooch very very unique i love love this brooch look at it it just looks nice on black outfits really beautiful yeah so i've got another like a branch or bouquet of flowers and then i have this butterfly i don't know what this is used for if you know let me know it's got like a thing you can unscrew and attach to something i'm not sure what it's used for so let's put those away and then have did I show you this cameo? I think I did. I did. You've seen this cameo. And uh, I've got another one with pears. And I've got a huge owl. Both antiques. Wow. This is can be vintage, but this is really antique. I think this that's a modern one. This to me, it looks modern. The black one looks modern as well. So let's move this away. And I have another one that is missing a lot of stones, just like a flower. So beautiful. I have another antique one. And another antique, which is missing a rhinestone there. I mean, it's missing a pearl or something. And then I have another beautiful blue uh, brooch. I like this one also. I like the colors, the light blue and the white. So it's another stunning piece that I have. So this is all I had to share or I had to show you today. Thank you so much for your time. If you enjoyed watching this video, give me a thumbs up. And if you have anything to say, leave me a comment down below. If you're new, you've not subscribed to my channel, please subscribe to watch more of my videos. I do mostly, actually, I do handbags, especially designer handbags and vintage bags. And yeah, thank you so much for your time. I'll see you soon. It's bye for now.